Let's take a look now at the Adelo Express table service screen. The system has very, very vertical specific screens that you can set up to begin the transaction. This particular one is the table service screen, but there's a screen layout for each different vertical, whether it's quick service, bar, retail. You can start the transaction uh, part of the way through it, actually. So if you're in a quick service operation where you do one transaction after the other, that will look different than a table service where you're now selecting a table and how many guests and what have you. So this particular one we're going to look at is the table service screen. Then we're going to look at the order recall and new order screen. This is where you would begin the transaction. So here we go. Let's take a look. Each different vertical that you may install Adelo Express into has a different screen that begins the transaction. The one that you're looking at now is for a table service or casual dining application. And that what you're going to look at on the screen are this center area is where we have the different tombstones is what they're called. They're just different the different tables that are already open for that server. So any previous transactions that were already rung will show up here in the center and to recall that table you just touch it. Down the left hand side of the screen are various sorting buttons that allow you to sort through the different order that are in the system. This allows you to order, uh, recall them by server, by type, whether that is dine in or to go, uh, a status being open or closed, or you can begin a new order by touching this new order button. The two little buttons here, the two little lights, tell you that there are others below that so that you can scroll up by just gesturing or swiping up or down. The function keys to the right, these blue keys stay here most every page. So they're a consistent thing to look at. Gives the operator, it, they just know, they just know right where to go. The button at the top is for exiting the lookup screen that you're on now. The next button down is to print the order that, you're, that you'd like to print on demand. These three little dots, uh, the programmers call those the ellipsis buttons, which then access different functions behind the scenes. The dollar sign actually is it's kind of easy to understand. That's the media button where you can go and cash out or tender out the, the, the sale. And the checkbox at the bottom, that is your end of order or done button. Across the top, you're going to have those three same buttons or lines that allow you to recall or exit into the manager area. The status, which is new order, is shown here. And then on the right is an item lookup. We'll, sh we'll talk about that later. Ticket window across the center. It's nice and wide. There's a lot of functions that will show if, in regard to that. If you want to see what it looks like with items in it, there it is. I've recalled that, that check that was already open. That's the screen layout for a table service application.